Yo, what up everybody? It's your boy Fitzmonk TV here, aka G 33 and I'm back here with another video on the channel. We just got some cool Dragon Ball Super manga panels from Jump Carnival. These are from Tortaro. Remember, Dragon Ball Super Manga Chapter 50 just came out a couple days ago. A really good chapter. If you guys haven't checked it out yet, go to Viz Media. But um, at Jump Carnival, Toritaro revealed some new panels, and they look actually pretty sick. They give us some more insight into the Dragon Ball Super Broly movie in the, um, in the manga. If you guys remember, Toritaro and Toriyama decided to skip the Dragon Ball Super Broly, um, arc in the manga. The reason why they did this is the movie was already out so they felt like there was really a need to go do the manga at this point in time plus they wanted to get as far as ahead of the anime as they can because we know eventually the Dragon Ball Super anime will come back to TV. Hopefully by the end of this year, but we we don't know as of right now. So they wanted to you know start telling new stories so they could be ahead of the anime when the anime comes back. But still, um, we see that during the moral arc, Goku, Vegeta are on the Glass Patrol ship. They're talking to Jacko and Mira, just letting them know stuff that's been going on. And he actually explained a little bit about Broly. We guys see in this panel, Goku's explaining a, more about Broly, who he is. I want to thank DBS Hype and Super DBS Chronicles for posting this. Plus, I want to thank those who translated the scan. And I really love this panel right here, all right? You guys can see, you know, Frieza ship in the background. You got Frieza watching on. And you have Broly in his Super Saiyan form. You have Vegeta and Goku who are in Super Saiyan Blue going up against Broly. A little, it looks a little bit different from the Broly uh, movie because, you know, at this point in the Broly movie, Goku and Vegeta's Gi, their uniform was pretty much destroyed at this point. And, you know, you can see the damage on their faces. You know, in the manga, you know, you can see their their um, their um uniforms, their Gi are pretty much still intact. But also here, for the first time ever, we get to see Gogeta in the manga we've never seen Gogeta in the manga before not in dbz or in dbs we've seen vegeto but we've never seen Gogeta in the manga and i really like the way he looks he looks pretty damn cool so we have Gogeta here in super saiyan blue um you can also see um goku vegeta fusing in the Gogeta for the first time and you can see piccolo here in the background uh, moving on to the other side of the screen you can see um Basically, for the most part, the what happened in the movie basically happened in the manga. You see Gogeta fires off the full power Kamehameha wave. And then at the last second, as it's about to hit Broly, um, we see that Chile um, wishes to Shenron that Broly be brought back to his planet. And you see Goku and Vegeta um, letting them know about Planet Vampa. All right, Jacko asks, why would Broly go back to that planet, you know, even um, knowing it's a bad environment? Goku's like, oh, because I think um, he really likes it there. Vegeta's like, it probably has something to do with his father. That's really all we get into that. Hopefully, we see Broly eventually return in the manga or in the anime. I love Dragon Ball Super Broly. I love, you know, how they break, how they finally made Broly canon. I love this new version of Broly, and I hope we see more of him in the future of DBS. As you guys can see, they also put one last scan here. Um, we see Bardock. We see King Code. We see uh, Paragus. We see King Vegeta. And we all see Goku's mom, Gine. Alright, pretty cool panel right there. Alright, love the Dragon Ball Super Broly movie. Probably my favorite Dragon Ball Super movie. Probably my favorite Dragon Ball movie of all time. Alright, let me know in the comment section what you guys think of these panels. Um, just wanted to make this quick video on that. Uh, I'm going to get out of here, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Other than that, that's all I got for you guys today. Have a great day, guys. Peace.